خمسة أربعة ثلاثة اثنان واحد بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم مرحبا جميعا صباح الخير أو مساء الخير depends on where you are أنا عز الدين and you are watching learn Arabic language with Z كيف حالكم اليوم السبت السبت اليوم السبت today's new vocabulary are بيت and مدرسة بيت و مدرسة. As you remember that if we have tamar bota, this word will be a feminine word, and bait is a masculine word. We can make it al bait, and we can make it al madrasa. In the previous video, we learned three of حروف الجر. We learned min, ila, and an. اليوم, today, we will talk an about a new one. This is Super Mario again. He's going to the sunduk. Now Super Mario is ala. Last one is without dot, so it's a ala Super Mario ala a sundo ala sundo. Where is he going? Now Super Mario is fi a sundo. Super Mario fi a sundo. Aina Super Mario aina aina Super Mario in the left he is fi aina. It's a question. Aina in the left he is fi in the right he is ala. Now we need to answer this. We have number one, the bird. Number two, the dog. Number three is the bird again. So number one, number one, aina, aina the bird, aina, the bird is ala, the bird is ala al bait, ala al bait, ala al bait. رقم اثنان. Number two, aina the dog, the dog is fi, fi al bait. Number ثلاثة, the bird again. The bird is على. على. So we talked عن, about على, وفي, على and في. The last one is ب. ب will come like using or by. So in English we will say I'm writing using a pen. In Arabic we will say I'm writing ب the pen. ب the pen. I'm going to madrasa or school by bus. Now we can say B bus. So B will be for using or by. So we learned min, ala, ila, an, fi, and B. Now I want you in the end of any word came after حروف الجر or the prepositions. I want you to put كسرة in the end. This is not one hundred percent correct, but in general and for now we want to learn it like this. Okay, if you did a mistake, what will happen? No one cares. You are learning. You are not in a competition. You are not in a race. So you can make mistakes as more as you want. Okay, do you remember the introduction when we learned that any language has letters and from these letters we make words and from words we make sentences and like this? Okay, now we have a, la, wa, la, da, for example. Then we will put them, depends on the shakil. Or the shape of their position. After that, we will connect it. It will be al-walad, al-walad. Then we will put preposition. For example, fi in. Then we will put al-bait, al-walad, fi al-bait. And we have a simple sentence: al-waladu fi al-bait, al-waladu fi al-baiti. The kasra on baiti because it came after preposition. It came after fi. Al-waladu fi al-baiti. We can make it al walad fi al sayyara because we learned also the meaning of sayyara. So al walad fi al sayyara, which we pronounce it as sayyara. So together it will be al walad fi al sayyara. Al walad fi al sayyara. We can make it al bint fi al bait. Al bint fi al bait. It will be al bint fi al bait. Al bint fi al bait. Al bint the girl. في البيت، or we can make it الولد في سيارتي. The boy is in my car. الولد في سيارتي. So we can make it الولد في البيت، or الولد في البيت، و الولد في السيارتي. And we can make it البنت في البيت، or البنت في السيارتي. Now again, but this time you will try to make a sentence. أين ماريو؟ أين؟ 
Yes, exactly. It's where. So, Aina Mario, where is Mario? The right one, the first one. Pause the video and think. Now I will answer Mario ala sunduk. This is a sentence. Mario ala sunduk. The left one. Aina Mario. Aina Super Mario. Pause the video to answer. Okay, the answer is Mario fi sunduk. Mario fi sunduk. Now again, we will use with these, but we will make it sentences this time. The top right one. Al usfuru ala al bayti. Al usfur ala al bayti. The bird is on the house. The left one. Al kalbu fi al bayt. Al kalb fi al bayti. The dog is in the house. The down one. Al usfur ala al tabak. Al usfur ala al tabak. Don't care about tabak now. Tabak is plate, but don't care about it right now. So when I ask, I will ask with aina where aina the dog. Or I know last four or I know anything. Later we will talk about how to form a question. Now the answer will be al kalb fi al bayt al asfur al bayt al asfur al tabak. Or I can change it. I will make it asfuruka al al bayt your bird for masculine singular asfuruka al al bayt your bird is on the house asfuruki al al tabak or kalbi fi al bayt. Now I can use. These two vocabulary also, I can say من البيت إلى المدرسة. بيت can be house and home, both of them. من البيت إلى المدرسة. Or من بيتي إلى المدرسة. From my بيت إلى المدرسة. Or I can make it إلى مدرسة إلى my مدرسة. As you see, the time ربطة will be converted to normal time. Also, I can use من بيتك إلى المدرسة or من بيتك. إلى المدرسة or إلى مدرستكم or إلى مدرستنا depends on the sentence you want to make. So now we learned how to use من على إلى عن ب and في. I want you in the comments to use any of these words. Just make a simple sentence. Use the preposition with the word after the preposition, but it should be meaningful. 